after tonight's meeting. Father, we prophesy over the oil. Yes. We turn this oil into the power of the Holy Spirit. Yes. As we apply the oil, yes. let the healing take place. Yes. Lord. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Let emotional healing take place. Yes. Lord. Let spiritual healing take place. Yes. Lord. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Every yoke of the enemy. Yes. Shall be broken. Yes. Shall be lifted up. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Apply the oil in your hands and put your hands on your head. Put it in your head. Now, if you have two so close the bottle. Now, if you cut out one, no, there is going to be a move of the Spirit of God. Now, right now, everybody, you must see how the fire and them healing will take place. I have said, Eba, that sickness that have been there for years, yari aya kuanko, I will vanish from today. Eba, Daniel, free one day. That chronic sickness will vanish. That migraine is living tonight. In the name of Jesus. That fabric is living now. In the name of Jesus. You are receiving your healing right now. It's taking place right now. In the name of Jesus. It's taking place right now. Wherever you are standing. That headache is living. In the name of Jesus. That stomach ulcer is living tonight. In the name of Jesus. Your healing is taking place now. Receive your healing. 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 Right now. Receive it now. It's taking place. Right now. All over the place. Yes, Karina. In the name of Jesus. That sickness. Yes. It's living now. Yes. In the name of Jesus. It's living now. Yes. It is going now. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Yes. So what's pain? Hey. It's living now. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Right now. Yes. Receive your healing. Yes. Receive your healing. Yes. Receive your deliverance. Yes. By the power yes. of the Holy Spirit. Yes. Right now. Yes. It's taking place. Yes. All over the place. Yes. Right now. 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 Yes. Receive it. Yes. Receive it. Yes. Receive it. Yes. Receive it. Yes. Receive Receive it! Somewhere. Receive it! Somewhere. Receive it! Somewhere. Take it now! Somewhere. That heart problem hey. is living. Hey. The heart problem it's living. We cancel the oppression. We will never go through the oppression. We will never go through. In the name of Jesus, we cancel it by the power of the Holy Spirit. In the name of Jesus, receive your healing right now. In the name of Jesus, we cancel the oppression. In the name of Jesus, receive your deliverance. Receive your healing. In the name of Jesus, right now. Lift up your hands. Peter will stop every Biara will Biara. The Lord is sending healing into your marriage. If you are not married here, but you represent a family, that marriage is a war. The devil divided your father and your mother's marriage. And because of that, you went through pain. Healing is coming to you right now. And I prophesy in the name of Jesus. You will never go the same way your father and your mother went. You are married. But you are not enjoying marriage. Something is about to shift. The atmosphere. In your family, people are not lucky in marriage. Every single person who has gone into a marriage has a bad story to tell. You will be the first to tell a good story. 
Lift up your hands. I will say, if you are not married, I want you to represent a sister, a brother, an auntie, an uncle, or a mother, or somebody. Reverend Agri. Marriage is supposed to bring joy into the family, peace, love into the family. Ever since you got into that marriage, even the little joy that you were having is missing. Everybody knows that you are married. But you in the marriage, you know you are single. Tonight, the Lord is bringing that joy into that marriage. That marriage that has never produced anything good will see the goodness of the Lord. That marriage that has never been a blessing to any society will be a blessing to the church. That marriage that cannot cause the children in the house to be smiling will cause the children to be smiling from tonight. That husband in the marriage who can never smile will begin to smile tonight. Place your right hand on your head. The mercies of the Lord will reach you wherever you are. Just join your faith with mine. And let's tap into the anointing upon the Apostle General. And the marriage blessing that is in his marriage. And cause the healing power of the Lord to enter that marriage that has never seen fruitfulness. I declare in the name of Jesus that whatever it takes to bring that marriage to the level where everybody will know that Jehovah is with you. I prophesy that thing into that marriage tonight. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Whatever will bring that joy the joy of the Lord, yes. which is the strength that you need into that marriage. I speak that thing into that marriage tonight. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Healing is getting into that husband's heart. Yes, Lord. Healing is getting into that wife's heart. Yes, Lord. Healing is getting into that those children. Yes. Lord. Healing is getting into that family. Yes, Lord. The joy of the Lord is entering that family. Yes, Lord. The peace of the Lord is entering that family. Yes, Lord. The excitement of the Lord is reaching you. Yes, Lord. Fruitfulness of the Lord is reaching you. Yes, Lord. Receive it in Jesus' name. I receive, receive it. Receive it in Jesus' name. I receive, receive it. it in Jesus' name. I receive it. That which people have been seeing and have been laughing at you will be no more. Amen. Your marriage will receive the strength of the Lord. Yes, Lord. From tonight. Yes, Lord. From tonight. Yes, Lord. Your marriage yes. will bring joy ah. to your society. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. The blessings of the Lord. Yes, Lord. The blessings of the Lord. Yes, Lord. Will be established in that marriage. Yes, Lord. From tonight. Yes, Lord. Receive it in Jesus' I name. Receive, it. receive the joy of the Lord. I receive, receive it. the fruitfulness of the Lord. I receive in the name it. of Jesus. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Just run in the park. Just some tea. Just a pro. No. Just the pan is like what we are so. But we still need your radio here. Face a partner. Face. I want you to use the anointing oil to make the sign of the cross three times on the forehead of your partner. And then partner, you also make the sign of the cross three times on the forehead of your partner. The first one you say in the name of the Father. The second one you say in the name of the Son. And the third one you say in the name of the Holy Spirit. 
Stop. Stop. Listen to the instructions carefully. Alright. Anoint his or her forehead. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Son. In the name of the Holy Spirit. Do it for your partner. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Shout a big Amen. Amen. The, the Amen was too small. Amen. Shout it like something is coming from heaven. Amen. Colors stir up an atmosphere. Numbers stir up the atmosphere. And also, as a son, Yama, I will be the number for Royal House Chapel this year is number 17. You watch the 17th of each month of the year. Position yourself because something will happen. The Amen was very weak. Yeah. Reverend Johnny, listen to this testimony coming and position yourself. Because you are the next to be celebrated in the house. Come on, if you are ready, give a shout unto the Lord. As you listen to this testimony, you are next in line for a miracle. Prophesy to yourself and shout, I am ready. I am ready. Reverend King, what did the Lord do for our brother? Well, this is our brother, George Oforiata. Mm. George Oforiata came to the week of the altar 2010 mm. with a bedding. Right. He works with the company and he had wanted to further his education, wanted to do his master's. Mm. And according to him, in the workplace, there is a fund that would normally be assessed by workers who want to further their education abroad. All right. So he put in an application. Mm. And strangely, the very year he put in an application, he was told that the fund had been suspended. Mm. It means that his dream to study abroad had been suspended. Mm. So he came to the week of the altar and petitioned the God of Royal House Chapel. Mm. That are, many of my colleagues have assessed this fund and they are better off. I will not be denied. Hey. Somebody shout, this Kala, year Bala, I shall Bala. not be denied. You shall not be denied. And prayed. Mm. So in the course of the year, he was told that the fund has been restored, how be it, partially. That's right. So it meant that if uh, five people were supposed to assess it, it has been reduced to either two, two, thereabout. So he wasn't perturbed. He put in the ap application. And finally, a whole lot of people put in the same application. They were shortlisted to only three. Mm. And out of the three, the odds were against him. Mm. So he came back to the uh, Royal House Chapel. And what did you say? You came to one of the pastors, you went to the altar again, and you petitioned God. Yes, uh, I came to church on the Sunday, and after church, Pastor King is my, um, uh, the leader. So he came to church, and one of the pastors went with it to the, uh, the altar, mm -hmm. and we prayed mm -hmm. that out of the three, out of the three. He said it was only one that would be considered. Hey. And we said once he's a royal hey. and he's a covenanted son, hey. may the favor of God may the favor locate of God. him. Hey. Prophesy to someone that the favor of the Lord will locate you right now. And so truly, the, mm. out of the three, the two were refused. Mm. He was the only one that was chosen. Hey. No, no wonder the man of God made you to make a cross on the forehead of your partner. I said this year, 2013, hey. when the favor of God is located for somebody, that favor will rest upon you. Who am I prophesying to? I am the May one. the favor of Jehovah locate you. So the favor located him. The favor located him. Mm. He had what he wanted. Traveled to Holland, mm. Erasmus University of Rotterdam, Hague, hey. in Holland. To study public policy management. It took him close to two years. As we stand here, he had completed his master's 
And because the miracle began hey. from here, he's here to testify to the goodness of the Lord God of royal house. Come on, give the Lord a hand of praise. Whatever you begin this year, I say you will end it. It will never be aborted. Amen. You will never be disappointed. Hey. Who am I prophesying to? I am this is one. your year of celebration. Let somebody give the Lord a shout of praise. Amen. We, well, re we rejoice with you, brother. We rejoice with you. Huh. We cannot wait to see the next chapter of your life open. Amen. Any other thing that is left, once the Lord has begun, he surely will do it. Amen. If you believe it, come on, put your hands together for the Lord. God bless you. Those who are sowing into this one, 2013, may you realize your dreams. According to the word of the Lord, numbers and colors have spiritual significance. They do. As if we are joking. Reverend James, come over. Someone came praying with us. He was invited to church. He listened to the message. He was a visitor. Say a visitor. A visitor. He listened to the message on colors and says, wow, I've never heard this before. Then it so happened that he had to travel. Let me write that one carefully. Yeah, I'll do it for Reverend James. It, it so happened that he had to travel. <laughs> yes. Then he decided to put into practice what he heard in church. Reverend King, <laughs> what did he do? This year, may your colors speak for you. Hey! Like Reverend Johnny said, he was a visitor. Mm. Came and had a powerful exposition mm. on the colors. So he decided to pray with us. Mm. Monday he was here, Tuesday he was here. That's the right. next day, Wednesday, he was built to travel to the UK. That's right. And whilst on his way, he decided to go with his favorite color. Ladies and gentlemen, he was traveling on economy class. Tell somebody economy. Whether you understand <laughs> it or not, say economy. <laughs> your survival. Lift up your oil. James.